The most exciting thing right now is AI. And if I just look at uh, Qualcomm right now, one of the largest uh, processor growth area in our chips is really AI processing. And it's amazing what's happening with AI outside the data center. We are moving towards this hybrid AI architecture. It's not, it's not efficient or economically viable to you to apply those large language models for everything if everything you have to go to the data center. And the ability to run that locally on your phone and things that you needed to do, you're gonna be chatting with your phone and you can do that in the phone and using 5G you can connect the cloud, so those are like one single computer connected to 5G in between. That's going to be one of the biggest change in user experience in the next few years. So as a user, so I've been using obviously ChatGPT and Bing a lot and, and things like Stable Diffusion and uh, Dolly. There's that delay, right? You put in your prompt, it goes out to OpenAI or Microsoft servers, takes, I don't know, sometimes a minute, sometimes 30 seconds to a minute, maybe longer to get that return of that information. What you're really promising is better speed there and because that's happening on the device? 